Simply solving Saturdays, boy. You better get that out of here. Yes, today is Simply Solving Saturdays where we're gonna solve some riddles, answer some questions, yeah man. Please go ahead, comment down below what riddles we should solve next. And if you enjoy these videos, then go ahead and smack that like button. And everybody, please subscribe to my gaming channel, Yeah Matt Smith. It's the first link in the description below. And let's go! Okay, which one is a real mermaid? Uh, the one on the left looks real. The middle, why she have a mustache? You be a merman. And then the one on the right is above water. So the one left, one left. I'm going to the one left. Okay, he said that one got a mustache. And she outside the water, that ain't it. Come on, girl. <laughs> you can't be out there. Yup. Which one is it? The one on the left, baby. Which werewolf is real? Oh my god, I, I don't know. Okay, all right, so the one on the left, he's out during the day, that can't be him. The one on the far right, that's not a full moon. I'm going with the one in the middle, cause it's a full moon, right? That looks real to me. Uh-oh, uh-oh, yep. Gotta be night time. Yeah, that's during the day. That ain't it, man. Ain't no werewolves during the day, and this one, uh, there ain't no brown werewolf. No, I'm just kidding. That one's not a full moon, but the middle is the full moon. Yeah, man, that's what I'm talking about. Whoa, moving on. What will you do if a bear attacks you uh run away no i'm just kidding okay all right guys which one do you think it is run away climb a tree pretend to be dead or maintain eye contact um i don't know i say climb a tree no no pretend to be dead yeah yeah pretend to be dead yeah i got yeah I think I got it. You wouldn't climb a tree because bears can climb trees. Bears are really good at climbing trees. So like, yeah, if you just pretend to be dead, you just got to like hope that they'll leave you alone. You probably don't want to run away because a bear can catch up. So, you know, you gotta, yeah. Don't maintain eye contact because they take that as a threat. Okay, now, what will you do if a lion attacks you? Ooh, 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 ooh. Maintain eye contact, run the zigzag, attack their eyes, pretend to be dead. Oh, that's tough. Ooh, um, I say pretend to be dead. That's what I say. Maintain eye contact? What, really? I don't know about that one. I mean, I guess I got it wrong, but like, you know, I feel like animals take that as a threat. They like, oh, what, you wanna square up? You trying to tussle? Not today, Mufasa, not today. How would you treat a jellyfish sting? Okay, do you guys know? What do you do? Do you pee on it? <laughs> do you wash it with salt water, wash it with hot water, or cover it with the sand? What do you guys think? I'm going with A, peeing on it. Wait, what? I thought you peed on it! Wait, what? Oh, where? Have movies been lying to me? Like, like, what is it like when somebody gets stung with by a jellyfish or something? Like, there's somebody who like pees on it. Was that a myth? My life is a lie. I was wrong. <gasps> oh! Okay, one more. What would you do if an elephant attacks you? Oh man, uh, run away in a zigzag. Attack their eyes, pretend to be dead, hiding behind a tree. What do you guys think? Uh, A, B, C, or D? I'ma go with. D, hiding behind a tree. That sounds right. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Yeah. Sorry, Dumbo. You can't find me behind a tree. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. The abandoned house. Uh oh. Tony was walking in the woods and suddenly he stopped in front of a big house. The house looked abandoned, so Tony decided to check it out. But as soon as he entered, the door closed behind him. Ooh. Tony found a sign saying that the door is now closed. But there are four doors that are not closed and can be used to exit the house. Mm -hmm. Behind the first door is a hungry shark. Ugh. Behind the second door, there is a well filled with water. Hmm. Behind the third door is a room filled with toxic gas. Dang. Behind the fourth door is a criminal who has assaulted people since 1918 and has already ended the lives of more than 100 people. Jeez. Which door should Tony choose to get out of this house unharmed? What See if you can figure out the answer to this one. What do you guys think? All right, 10 seconds. Shark, well, toxic, or criminal? What are you guys going with? I'm going with the criminal because if he's been a criminal since 1918, uh, more than likely he's done a uh, passed on. So what do we got? The answer is the fourth door. Although the criminal looks and is dangerous, he may be over a hundred years old and he is likely already dead. That's what I'm saying. Or at least he'll be too old and unable to cause him any harm. That's right. Yeah, mate. Woo! 
that's how we do it. All right, on to another one. How many characters do you see here? Count them all. Okay, all right, how many? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, nine, ten. I see those little guys. I got ten. I count ten, baby. Come on, give it to me. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, we got it. We got it. I'm talking about. All right, uh, we got to try to find the odd image. Which is the odd one out? Spot the difference. What do we got? Okay, all right. I see it. I, I got it. Come on, you guys got it? Second row, all the way to the right. Towards the right. Yeah, there he is. The sad face. Woo. All right, spot the difference. Wait, oh shoot, this is confusing. Which one is different? Um, yeah, the, oh, wait, wait, next to bottom row, next to bottom, yeah, I saw, I saw it the last second. Okay, find two animals that are exactly the same. All right, so, so there's, uh, duplicates of one animal in here. Which one? The cheetah, tiger, is okay, I see that. Uh, ah! I don't know! Oh, wait, 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 there's rap, I think I made it right under the, yeah, I think I got that one. Give me that. That's what I'm saying, man, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, can you find two emojis that look the same? Oh, shoot. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look at the song! I can't even tell, I have no idea. <gasps> oh, I done messed up, man. All of y'all look alike. Or, I mean, I mean, uh, I could tell the difference. Three zombie girls are chasing Jake. One of them is his girlfriend. Which one is it? I, I don't know. Okay, A, one says Emma, one says Lucy. Um... I'm gonna go with B, Lucy, because his tattoo says J plus L, right? Yeah, look, 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 yeah, J plus L, so J plus Lucy. Okay, all right, we got it, baby, we got it. Aw, Lucy turned into a zombie. She's a zombie. I'm sorry, Lucy, it didn't work out, it didn't work out, sorry. She's now on The Walking Dead. All right, now we got some math. Oh, yes, let's do it, baby, come on. How many total squares are there? Ooh, all right, count them out, three, six, nine, seven. Okay, I count 14, like total squares. Like the big ones, the little, yeah, I count 14. Come on, give it to me. Wait, nine, wait, wait, 10, yep, yep. 11, 12, 13, and then the big one. 14, baby, I want to talk about it. Hey, hey, I know my maths. I do the maths, I do the maths. Okay, uh, when Lisa was six years old, her sister Lucy again was half her age. If Lisa is 40 years old today, how old is Lucy? Okay, all right, all right, I, I know it, I know it. Come on, guys, this is an easy one, this is an easy one. Lucy would be 37 years old, am I right? Or am I right? I want that cake, that cake looks good, though. That cake looking really good. 37, baby, come on, woo! Yes. I feel so dang smart. Yeah, man. Lisa is three years older. Okay, easy peasy, uh, booty squeezy. One more with the math. Okay, here we go. Get your calculator out. What are three different whole numbers whose sum and product are equal? Three different whole numbers whose sum and product are, oh shoot. Uh, two, three, and uh, six. I don't know. I have no idea, guys. I, I, I don't know. Two, three, and six. I need, I need time to write it out. Two, three, and six. Hey, I got two, three, and one. Okay, all right, that's like half a point. Give me a half a point, baby. One plus two plus three equals six. One times two plus, oh yeah. I was kind of right. Two, three, and six. Oh, nah, nah. I'll get that. was like half a point. All right. Okay. Can you find the mistake? Yep. I think I found it right here. <laughs> okay. Can you find the mistake? All right. So one, two, three, four, five, seven, nine. Blah. Where is it? Oh, wait, I got it. I got it. Find the Miss Lake. You forgot the T right there and mistake. You dummy. <laughs> yes, that's what I'm talking about. That's how we do it. Okay, another one. All right, can you find the mistake? All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, four. Eight. Wait, share it. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. All right, I'll give you guys a chance to find the mistake. All right, it says share it when you find the, the mistake. You put the two times, you dummy. That's the mistake. Woo! Let's go, baby, let's go. Give me my money. Okay, here we go, one more. Can you find the mistake? All right. Uh-oh, oh no. Oh, wait, I don't know. Can you find the miss? Oh, wait, there's a one. There's a one in mistake. Oh, you almost got me on that one. Y'all almost got me. That was close. That was good. I, I almost didn't get that one. That was really close. But that's gonna wrap it up for today's video. If you enjoyed, go ahead and smack that like button. But yeah, stay safe out there. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Until then, peace.